Members, we are going to return to privileges of the floor. Senator Glazer at the pro tem's desk. For what purpose do you rise? Uh, privileges of the floor, purposes of introductions. Please proceed. Thank you, Madam President and members. Uh, you know, uh, we're celebrating uh, Autism Awareness Month here uh, in the month of April. And I'm, I'm very honored to welcome to the Senate floor some very important constituents of mine. Uh, let me first say that uh, we have a wonderful uh, organization uh, in my district called Sunflower Hill. It's a nonprofit that provides individuals with special needs lifelong residency options uh, that not only for residency but for quality activities and programming. And the need for housing is significant. Uh, there are currently about 17,000 individuals in Alameda County who need housing uh, in the next few years and about 11,000 in Contra Costa County. And Sunflower Hill has some wonderful projects underway to create this type of special housing uh, throughout uh, my uh, neck of the woods. Um, we have here some very special guests in this special month of autism awareness. Uh, I'd like to introduce uh, Patrick Kerbach, who is a senior at Miramonte High School, go Mats, uh, and a volunteer with Sunflower Hill. He's here with his mother, Rosemary Kerbach, who's a volunteer board member at Sunflower Hill and also provides legal counsel along with uh, his father, Lee Kerbach. And also joining us is Blake Muller, who is a student at Foothill High School in Pleasanton, a wonderful part of my district, along with his father, Dave Muller, who is a volunteer board member with Sunflower Hill, also acting as the CFO and treasurer. So senators, I'd like to ask you to join me in welcoming to the Senate floor these fine uh, individuals. Thank you, Senator Glazer. Welcome representatives of Sunflower Hill.